Welcome to the Kimia Wellness YouTube channel. Today we'll be sharing a part of the episode we recorded on the Gedaya Fenster podcast. We are discussing how the organs in Chinese medicine affect the physical and spiritual realm. So kidneys. Kidneys have to do with water, the emotion is fear. And so people that are, are it's balanced, they're strong will, they have willpower, they're determined, their tendency to self, they're sufficient, they're independent, they're knowledgeable, they're understanding, they seek knowledge. And on the other hand, if they're off balance, they're introspective, they focus too much on their inner world, mm -hmm. they become withdrawn, they don't speak to other people, they... Anxiety. Anxiety. And that's the fear, right? right? And so we have to realize that we have to let go of these fears. You would say depletion of energy would probably be related to, to kidney deficiency, right? Because you, right. you're just wasting all the energy on fear. What energy do you have left? That's, that's part of it. The, the other part of it, it has to do with the jing of the body, which is the essence of the body. Mm. And as you go through love, life, you're depleted by working hard, by playing hard. You're taxing yourself, right? So if that's depleted on top of having the emotions of fear, on top of not taking yourself of yourself and balancing your life, you're gonna get conditions uh, such as um, fluid uh, imbalance, uh, urinary I I issues, uh, reduced libido. You're gonna experience mild uh, aches and joint pain, especially in the knees and the lower back. We talked about you know kidneys have to do also with the lower back. A lot of people that come in right. with back pain, they're like, why do I have this back pain? I didn't do anything. You're dealing with fear. You're dealing wow. with, with something that's... Back is the support of the yeah, person's that's, life. That's your support, of the, especially financial, right? right? We see that a lot of situation, financial fear can cause lower back pain. Actually, that was one of the reasons right. I got into acupuncture. I was, I was dealing with a lot of fear in my life, a lot of anxiety. And I did some acupuncture. I was like, this is amazing medicine. Wow. You just put a few needles in the kidney channel and it just opens up things and lets things flow. And... It releases all that pain and all that. A lot of people are having fertility issues, and explain how that's related to the kidneys. And I've I've heard many people have gone to go to acupuncture for fertility issues. I guess that's because those are reproductive organs. Right. So the kidneys also have to do with the reproductive organ, with fertility, and when it's deficient or things are off balance, whether it's yin deficiency that it there's this lack of of of, he, of 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 heat or cooling of the body right so there's mm -hmm. more heat and then you get hot flashes and that that goes into menopause even but but then on the other side there's young too much heat right so you have to balance things out right so a lot of the times with the acupuncture we're able to get that flow get that balance in, get the right herbs and put the body back into balance and then people get uh, pregnant pretty easily wow pretty crazy yeah we would think it's it, you get caught up in the western medication western you, you lose track of the simple imbalance right because what is it because the western medication does that actually fix that what does that practically do well there is space for western medicine of course. right obviously when it's, needed, of course. when it's needed certain situation there's a certain age but when you're younger i have patients that come in when they're younger they're so stressed out there's so so much in fear so much in anxiety they can't even get pregnant. That shouldn't be the case. Okay, when you get in your 30s, 37 is the age you kind of like revert. But okay, in that situation, IVF comes into play. Right. But if you add in the acupuncture, increases it by 26%. The ability really? to wow. get the numbers? Fertile. Yeah, yeah. Wow. So that's the research that was done. Wow. So definitely that, that helps with, with, with preserving the, the essence of the body. What, what kind of foods are good for... Um what kind of foods so are good for, actually for... blue black foods that's the and a pinch of salt so black foods uh, like uh, berries mm. uh, black beans eggplants uh, wooden Warm mushroom blue and black. huh yeah. yeah and avoid obviously anything because it's over, already overtaxed avoid stimulants right any stimulants will definitely uh, cause more harm a little bit of uh, salt is okay but not a lot of salt obviously uh, all in moderation, and uh, and, I, and bitachon, trust in God. Yes, yeah, that's, that's the opposite. Right. It's funny how the kidneys in Hebrew is, is um, I think they're called uh, the, the same word as is, 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 is bitachon. I forgot the exact name. 
but the, the kidneys also in Hebrew means bitachon, some, some, I forgot the name of the... So uh, obviously here you could see how every single body part, you know, it, our emotions are basically, instead of suppressing our emotions, the practicality is, they're telling us something. Something right. your emotions are telling you something. Yes. You know, if it's a, if it's a if it's an issue with fear, you, it's telling you something. You lack trust. If it's an issue with the, uh, the heart, you're lacking you're lacking new vitality. You're lacking a renewal. You know, if it's an issue with the lungs, if the, you have an issue with the with the uh, with with your lungs, it's it's you have to let things go. You have to move get out of the past. You know, if right. you have an issue, you know, an issue with the liver, you have to stop you know controlling things. So at the end of the day, it's all it's all spiritual fixes. That's what it is. Yeah. Ultimately, it's a spiritual. It's all connected, right? The way. But you, how, how, would you start first with the, with the spirituality or, or the diet or both? Well, I start before I treat anybody. I start with a prayer to Hashem. Like the right. Ramam had a prayer. I have a prayer that I actually right. got from the previous Biala Rebbe, from my teacher, Doctor Yudah Frischman, that that taught you should, me. That you should be able to. Hit that the should, right organ. That should I be able to to be a, a, a channel, like we talk about being a channel all the time. Also, as a doctor, you're a channel. Right. So you want to come in as, you know, humbled and, and come in as, right. I'm a channel for Hashem's healing and let me be the right channel, give the right advice, the right treatment to, to help the person. So that's where it starts. And then, it, as I see it in my clinic all the time, we see it, especially after October 7th, we see all right. the symptoms that are coming out. We see, you know, with, with, with stress from work, from, from life. It's, it's, it's part of it. So if you are spiritually strong, like what you teach us here and everything that Rabbi Nachman teaches us is really to have that harmony. Know, harmony. And, and then from there, you can go, okay, well, what do I do? Let me get the best doctor. Yeah. Let, me, let me seek the, the best advice. Right. Again, according to your theory, it's your therapy. So if you really believe in this stuff, then you'll treat it on a, on a holistic level. And, right. and, and I've done that all the time and thank God it's, it's helped. One day it's this issue, one day it's that issue. But it's always something, you know, because after an event that we go through, there's always that emotion that sticks there. And you have to find a way to give it, you know, bring it up to wisdom because always that, that event will always create, you know, it will just irritate. You know, you, you, you have an issue in business, the next thing you know, the kidneys is gonna trigger that event and back and forth. So it's really very important, our sages tell us that after you go through a real event in life, you have to really, really give it the right meaning and then turn it into wisdom. Don't keep it on, on, on escrow and let it you know, constantly repeat and repeat because what happens is, is you, you constantly get irritated. It keeps on irritating the, the, the body part and then next thing you know, you're in that horrible loop again. Right. Horrible loop. And that's also we see in uh, trauma, right? right? So let's say somebody had a, uh, saw an accident, God forbid, and and they're able to go help. So they go help that person and then they come back, they're yeah. fine dealing with it, but they come back to their car and they're throwing up. That's like wow. the, all of a sudden your body just realized what you went through. So we see that PTSD. We see, you know, so, soldiers, God forbid, Hashem should bless them, Hashem should keep them safe. Yeah. But they, they go through so much of it. You know, we saw, we saw that person that went out to, to help the, the victims and, and, and you know, God forbid had a heart attack afterwards, wow. you know. It's so sad. It's real what, stuff. It's real what, stuff. So we have to be able to process it and to heal as a people, to heal ourselves, to heal, you know, to be able to, to become our best selves again because that's what Hashem wants from exactly. us. He wants us to grow from this and to be able to, to develop. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you so pleasure. much for having me. Can you tell us, tell us where you are in LA? So I'm in, in just in Los Angeles, just out, outside of Beverly Hills area. It's Kimia Wellness. You can check us out online. Beautiful. Would love to see you guys. Beautiful, beautiful. I will give a recommendation. I don't have it on me, but the, the, I have a person in Miami who's phenomenal. Um, but I, again, strongly recommend if there's if you have some chronic issues, uh, acupuncture is definitely the. It's worked for me. I, I, I definitely educated myself about it, so I know already. Okay, I have this issue. I got to talk to his bodhidut about this issue. So I really got so detailed into this, and it, it really, really heals tremendously. And you're healing from the inside. Absolutely. Instead of you know medicating pain, next all you're doing is blocking out the pain, but you still have the problem. You know all this other medication, you're blocking out pain, but you still have the issue. You right. still have the issue. So it's like you know having a shalom bite issue and putting earplugs on. You know it hasn't fixed the issue. It has not fixed the issue. You still got to deal with it. So you don't hear it right now, but you still have the issue. So may God help us all. Thank you for your work.
Please like and share the podcast. For future talks, subscribe to our YouTube channel and get the latest information. For any questions, email us at info at kimiawellness.com or call or text at 424-274-2632. Looking forward to see you soon. Heal your body and revive your soul.